welcome back to Press X for Chromosomes. Sorry, I nice. like started reading the fucking uh, oh, and got distracted titles. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> but anyway, it's time to go. They they uh decide. Oh, I gotta read this shit. Hard and high town. Decided to move in the mirror. Yeah, they decided to lock it up because it's been a bad. It's actually just fucking, just in case dudes come out of it. <laughs> oh, yeah, wow, that dude. is one very used mirror. <laughs> what? Huh? Because dudes keep coming out of it. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Look at those fuckers running down. We're going to get you. I'm going to get you. Oh, just you wait. Running through a tree. Oh, good. I was like, for a Bushes. second, I was like, shit, I need to put my shit back on. Oh, wait. <laughs> no. We're perfect and beautiful in every way. We are. Hey, homeboy. Hey. Hey. <laughs> All right. So here's a couple other secrets. Um, fucking up this ramp is shit Ooh. or whatever. Something. A skin. I think this is the skin that shields. Maybe. Maybe not. It's something, though. Cool. And I'm... then uh, you can examine the stone. And it'll be like, oh, right. fucking this is. Let's see where they were going. And then fucking this is like. This, oh, well, they fucking stupid bull talked over me. But that's like, oh, that's how they control the past. So you come back here and there's one of these fucking stones. Oh, guess what? Oh, okay, so now you get it here. This fucking, is a long pathway. Yeah. Come up here. Neat. And it also, like, it's crumbling behind you. Oh, gosh. I mean, it never crumbles on you, but well, it's, like, yeah. still. And up here is another thing. Is it another battle room? Yep. Okay. So you can kind of see in it when I'm not fucking... No. So yeah. That reminds me of a level... That one has revenants in it. Ooh, and it's fun. It's actually... I completed that one. That No. Yeah, the one that has the skin that shields, the fucking armor shit, is uh in like a prison. Oh, jeez. If I remember correctly. A little prison room. That room reminded me of a, a spiral level where you're stuck in like a church. Mm. And it's just like a round air... Like... um like the main portion of the church so there's like stained glass around and you have to like fly and like shoot things i vaguely remember that level really I played, well i played spyro a few times it but. was the third one if i remember right yeah yeah and you're like the little uh bird little fat bird flying around i remember the game frustrating me <laughs> i actually i have pyro spyro two and three <laughs> I um, have the knockoff brand of Spyro Pyro. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I have it on my PS3. I don't have the first one because the first one you can't swim in water and it frustrated me as a kid and it frustrates oh, yeah. me now. And oh, oh, well, like, why did that translate to Assassin's Creed? I don't know. <laughs> like, why do you. What? <laughs> what a stupid thing for you to, like, uh. It's like you guys, like, forgot about the water and were like, uh, he's just. The game over. <laughs> well, and it's, it's in Second Sun, too. If you hit the water, then you're bones you have to like teleport to the shore yeah which i found kind of dumb because that was a gen 4 release title yeah wait wait what what assassin's creed second son oh second son yeah yeah yeah, yeah no just straight also i'm like you were born in seattle bro or washington every kind of one fucking knows how to swim around here yeah yeah like, I have not met one person who does not know how to swim. I've met a couple people who sink immediately because their bones are pretty dense. Yeah, I mean, and, and you're Native American, bro. Yeah. Like, you extra should know how to swim. Yeah, well, and his tribe lives on the coast. Yeah. So, like, you're his made-up tribe. Yeah. The Skokomish or whatever. I fucking don't remember. <laughs> I just laughed at it. <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> That's not real. <laughs> as far as we know, at least. Oh, no. It's hell not real. Oh, okay. Yeah. Nice. Take out those. Friggin, uh. They're so cute. Whatever the company is. Made it up. <laughs> and then they made a... Uh... But they're based in Bellevue, so fuck it. They made one of our major highways into Seattle a tunnel. Oh road, yeah, and it's not. Yeah, isn't it the 520? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That is not. A, oh, that's a floating bridge. That yeah. is not a. 
like that had like pillars and shit and uh also a tunnel and i was like that's not and then i remember oh no it's i-90 is it i-90 maybe it's not because oh fucking i-90 i think is in the last of us yeah either way they're floating fucking bridges and i remember on seattle's now an island city yeah (laughs) and i was like what and i remember you made the joke of like when what's her face destroys the bridge now it's floating (laughs) yeah yeah I was like, I know what they did for gameplay purposes, but at the same time, come on. Yeah. Like, come on. Bro. It was fun, though, to, like, run around the Pacific Science Center and be like, I know exactly where to go. Yeah. I know. Well, it's like, well, and, like, some of the city was messed up, too, like, oh, placement-wise. But oh, it's like, yeah. you could go to Pike Place and yeah, stuff. Yeah, like, fun. And then, like, the Chinatown the district was completely different. I was like, the hell is this shit? This yeah. is way nicer. <laughs> yeah, I was like, this is not Seattle. Way like, cooler. Like, you've got Section 1, which is Seattle, and then you have Section 2, which is not Seattle. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it's Seattle still somehow. Yeah. You're like, no. Sorry, my hand is a little glowy. <laughs> I don't mind it. <laughs> Just pay no attention to that shit. Oh, you just have a glow stick in your hand. That's cool. It's interesting, too. A lot of the shit, if Bull's not in your party, Dorian is saying a lot of stuff that the Bull, because Bull was like, yo, you okay, boss? Or right. Whatever the hand. Dorian's like, whoa, fuck. Right. You okay? Yeah. Or whatever. But he's fucking, he doesn't give a shit now that Bull's here. Or just Bull takes priority over Dorian's yeah. cues. Maybe it's because, you know, it's the Canary. Could be. So. Maybe also they're like bull cares, even though he's kind of like whatever. I'm just here for a paycheck. But he does. He cares. Yeah. yeah. You're his buddy. Exterior. You yeah. you you saved his ferns, <laughs> even though he wasn't willing to make that decision. <laughs> yeah, that's always the thing too. Of like, I can't make the decision. You make it. I'm not emotionally invested in this. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, uh, well, okay. <laughs> One of my friends is making a playthrough of uh, her her Inquisitor cares only about like the number of the army, like how many people are in the army and that kind of stuff. And she made the decision to uh, sacrifice the chargers. Well, that doesn't work with the number of the army. I guess the like the whole oh, intelligence I guess, network I guess for and that fucking, kind of yeah, stuff. That makes more sense because I was like, that's sacrificing like direct people from your oh, army. Right. But no, and then you get, like, the reports from, like, Ben Hasrath and that kind of stuff. And, and yeah. the might of the Keen behind you and that kind of stuff. And I'm just like, you are in for a surprise, Trespasser. Because <laughs> she loves Bull. And I'm like, oh, boy. Are you going to be in a ride for your life? Yeah. <laughs> I don't have the heart to sacrifice the Chargers every single time. I'm like, the first time, it's like, decide. I was like, no. <laughs> And I'm like, ah, oh, fuck. Bye, Canari. Yeah. No, and I was just, like, now Bull's going to leave me probably. And he's like, no, I like your decision more. I'm a little bummed because my like entire life now, and now has he, been in shambles. Yeah, but now like, he's Talvis Shoth and he's just but like, I still oh. got my group. I got my buddies. Yeah, he's got Krem, like, oh. which is his kind of like weird son. Yeah, it's like, yeah, surrogate. Child. Surrogate child. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I'll check attention. Yes, blow up everything. I'm a fan. I'm a fan of blowing things up. <laughs> it's nice. That was one of my sister's reasoning of why I should watch a TV show, um, Burn Notice. Like I had like watched like the previous for it and it didn't like really grab me. But mm-hmm. then Tegan started watching it and she was like, "You should watch it. You would love it. There's explosions." And I was like, "Just because it has explosions isn't enough to grip me." My brother wanted me to watch it because he was he got the mistake of like I'm super into spy things and I was like I like sp- like spy stuff is cool, but it's not like the first requirement. Yeah, like I don't remember what I was like. Yeah, this is awesome. Like, but like I think the show I was like interested in like was funny too and uh-huh. had like kind of spy things. I was like this is neat or whatever. Like that's just an added bonus. Right. It's like yeah, this has fucking like spy shit and you'd really like it or whatever and it was just boring to me and i was like i mean i see the spy stuff and everything but it's not fun yeah i tried watching bird notice and i'm like this is just isn't like it has like it's a little bit too drama-y for me like i need a i need humor honestly for like and and maybe not entirely humor but like 
Like Jessica Jones is like fairly serious. Right. And stuff but like there's points. But there's in humor it. in it. Yeah. yeah. Um Um Could you die and not like the other things? <laughs> I wanna talk to Sarah. Fair question. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh fucking god. I've never heard that before, but to be fair, I don't have this exact group combination right. ever. Um Another thing, like, Bird noticed that bothers me. The direction, like, the camera direction sometimes, like, when it's, like, switching between scenes. And, like, it, because it'll, it'll play forwards, and then, it'll, like, it'll rewind weirdly, and then yeah. it'll play again. Oh, yeah. And it bugs the crap out of me. I don't know why, but I'm, it's just, like, there's no point. Yeah. Like, you're doing it just to make it look cool, and. It's not one of those places. Thanks, Sarah. See, and, like, I would never bring Varric along with her. Not because of, like, anything, but just because they're, like, the exact same fucking class. Right. So there's no reason to bring them together. But I'm really wondering what he'll say in response to her. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Jesus, bull. <laughs> oh, this is a long conversation. Okay. Well, yeah, it was kind of long. Like, Dorian Bull, canonically, if you do not date them, are in a relationship at this point. Oh, yeah, I forgot about They're, that. I'm not sure if it's like a fucking, like, forever relationship but they definitely hook up during the oh, main yes game they do. if you do not hook up with them and um it's explained like during like party yeah and sarah so like they have a good respect for each other even though they're technically on opposite ends of the spectrum yeah which is fun to see yeah now you can fucking explode shit so fucking and this is and you're invincible so oh wait no not yet also they're like you can shoot this i never have been able to shoot it and there we go. Oops. Ow. Yeah. <laughs> You'll murder yourself doing it. There. <laughs> but, um. Uh, uh, yeah. Like. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah. Like. So, like. But, so, they're friendly towards each other. And Bull and Sarah have, like. Sarah's okay. really friendly with, uh, uh er, Blackwall also. But they have, like, a fun, like, I'm going to, th like, throw you over the fucking wall or whatever. And you can kill them all. She's like, yeah. Like, they have a really friendly relationship, yeah. too. And it's like, it's just, this is a pretty good group. Yeah. Everyone's friendly at each other. Blackwall and Sarah have, like, a oh. weird, like, <laughs> almost, like, fatherly type thing. Yeah. Um. <laughs> then Sarah and black while pick on solace oh yeah fucking <laughs> oh man but soul so, kind of they all, he gets snarky with them and shit like that so uh since you're learned in spirits have you uh uh ever had sex with them <laughs> he's like fucking just <laughs> aghast he's like that fuck so you have tried <laughs> 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 fucking black wall <laughs> <laughs> all right what was the other one like uh doing magic wall peen that was like a sarah and black wall versus soulless type deal i don't remember i don't remember that one it was a conversation i think you got and you told me about it like i there, there was it was definitely like casting magic in urine was somehow all together in it i don't 100 percent remember <laughs> but there was a lot of shit that like souls was like the fuck <laughs> like whatever well, and like and also like and that kind of shit Souls has some fucking uh, humor. Yeah. Or whatever. You're like, Souls is so like solemn and shit, but he kind of gets into it oh, here yeah. and then. You're like, <laughs> you're a god. Well, <laughs> <laughs> this is fun shit. Because like, you're all like supposed to be noble and you kind That's of like try sad. to act the part and then you're like, <laughs> dick jokes also. <laughs> you're like, yeah, you're fucking. Mm, gods are human. Um, And then there's 
the one with the black ball. Hey, Solus, do you have any uh, tips about fighting demons? Yeah, it lasts longer than five seconds. <laughs> well, that's helpful. Well, no, because demons are stupid and all the tactics they're going to use is within five seconds. So wait five seconds, you'll know how to kill them. And <laughs> Blackwell's like, oh, that's really helpful, actually. I thought it would be something stupid, like, don't die. And Solus is like, oh, yeah, another thing. Don't, don't die. die. <laughs> <laughs> like, twisting the knife a little bit. <laughs> Like, I like Solus actually a great deal, especially after dating, because he's just kind of fucking, he gets humorous. Yeah. Like, after you get him to open up, you're like, yeah, (laughs) you're not a bad character. No. All these characters are very well written. Yeah, even Vivienne, despite the fact that, you know, we don't really like her. I mean, she's at least got her priorities and she knows what she wants to do. Well, and the thing that I appreciate that the writers kind of specifically have said about her is she's not supposed to be liked. Oh, okay. She, well, she's not she's not written to be liked by everyone. Yeah, or whatever. So I mean, like, and you guys did your job. Oh yeah, she definitely. rubs me the wrong way. Like, the and I want to like her. Like, there's a character in freaking Fire Emblem. I was like, I want to like you, but you keep fucking me over <laughs> consistently. And I do like him now that I got to know him, but, like, they fucking wrote him fucking assy like they were trying to. Oh, uh, Archer Boy? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, fucking. Yeah, I know who you're talking about. Takumi. <laughs> and see, playing that path first, I was like, I like Takumi! And I was like, Takumi! <laughs> I was like, it was fun at first, but dude, get a hint. I keep killing you. Kind of got annoying. Yeah, <laughs> kind of. <laughs> His bow's fucking awesome, though. Yeah. My bow's made out of magic. I did not get that impression when you were on my side, but cool. Now that I saw your fucking cutscene. Yep. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Fire Emblem's animation gets pretty great, and I'm kind of always sad that that just isn't the game, but it's on a DS, so I understand. Yes, that's my leg. Are you going to claw me again? Is he needing it? Yeah, he always needs everybody else but me, too. I'm like, thanks. He's got it in that weird bit where... I feel I'm moving a uh, little bit. Yeah, it's like that weird bit um, where when you're sitting, it's, you know, like the little um, curve between your leg and your, like, hip. Yeah. He's got his paw right there. And for some reason, that is very ticklish on me. So it's just like, cat, <laughs> don't make, don't tickle me, cat. Kitty. <laughs> yeah, and he's fucking, oh, the fu- oh, this is, oh hey, Dorian. <laughs> Guess what you get? Uh, yeah, and he always fucking, like, will find the place that's, like, the thinnest in clothing oh, to yeah. need. And you're like, what the? Fuck! Lamia, like, standing on, like, the pressure point right on the side of your leg. She stands on it constantly. I'm like, cat, cat, cat. <laughs> that hurts. Oh, yeah. He, like, leaned on me the other day, and he was cleaning himself, but, like, all of his weight was on his back foot, back <laughs> oh, heel, God. and it's just digging into my leg. And I'm like, you know, you're pretty love, heavy. <laughs> yeah, I love you, but this hurts. Yeah, you. this is really not comfortable. Uh, Molly... Uh, she loves being brushed. She absolutely loves being brushed. Yeah. And I've never looked uh, down here. This is the room. You can hear, kind. Of, you can kind of hear singing. At least I believe I heard singing when I was in here. I thought I just heard something. But to be fair, I've never actually stood here. Yeah. Because I, I saw that. So I like, this is presenting something yeah is that a bunch of fucking coffins i believe so cool yeah but that's all lyrium stuff and because they always talk about you know the singing of the lyrium and that kind of stuff well the red lyrium specifically i i want to say that they said something about that too like the regular lyrium Mm -hmm. i don't entirely remember and i could very well be wrong i've been wrong plenty of times yeah but well you you, to be fair i can't take your word with that shit because like i said i don't read the lore yeah or pay attention much to it like i kind of do so if it, it very specific you have to have my interest for me to read into right it. and a lot of the lore and shit doesn't, doesn't interest me you have to kind of present it up front in the game and then i'll be like oh okay right um or i'll like read into it if i'm like wait a second right and like but i was in that room and i swear to god i heard like some sort of like singing, singing and i was like this is kind of weird, but okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, I don't I don't remember hearing. 
but like I said, I was like, I got the shit and left because I was like, I don't, because I had trouble in here and I was like, I don't like this place. <laughs> oh yeah, I mean these fucking Canaria are annoying. Yeah, just a little. Gonna come down here, homies. Yeah, come on. Let's wait fight. I'm gonna wait for you because last time I was like climbing up the fucking thing <laughs> and you guys were just waiting for me at the top oh, and like a big dude like just like fucking swung oh. like bat up and just <laughs> swung and swatted me off. There and you are. And there went my head. Yeah, and one I fell fucking <laughs> off because it was like right at the top right. and I fell all the way down. Oh god. Hey, don't throw that shit at me, you fucker. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, and so I was like, God damn it. And then like. It was like stuck in a perpetual because my team was climbing up. Oh gosh! And so yeah. it was like stuck in a perpetual, like slide down, climb up, slide down, climb up, and I was like, <laughs> "Fucking Christ!" I remember at one point a dude got stuck right there, and that's not a place you can be really. So I had okay. to like fucking like use one of my. This is why you always have distance people on your team right. because something like that will happen, and then. Uh. Shall we blow up the other two next time? Ah uh, yeah. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Woo! It's already, like, lit looking, but I haven't detonated it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> However, <laughs> sorry, until next time. Lilia dies. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right here for your guys' amusement. <laughs> uh, yeah. Bye. Bye.